Right, Joe, welcome to Wormwood Football Club. Um, first of all, how does it feel to, to be here? Yeah, really excited. Um, happy to get it done. Um, really looking forward to obviously starting the season. I've spoken to the gaffer about how he thinks I'm going to fit into the team. And I think it's just what I needed um, at this stage of my career. So yeah, I'm really looking forward to getting going. You obviously had the, the opportunity to stay at Gateshead and decide to move on. And what was it particularly about, um, about the club that convinced you to come here? Um, well, location was a big factor in my decision, obviously about seven hours up to Gateshead, um, as well as the fact that I felt like I needed to be sort of a, a, almost a bigger player in the team. I wanted to obviously get as many games as I can. Um, and obviously this is a club going in the right direction anyway, and hopefully we can, you know, have a really good season and see where it takes us. Sure. You've had a bit of a frustrating couple of years with, with injuries and loan spells and stuff like that. Are you sort of hoping to settle here and, and to sort of show people what you can do on the pitch? That really get the Yeah, I mean, that's another reason why I decided to come here. I feel like the last two seasons um, haven't worked out for me as well as I would have liked. Um, and the gaffer here has given me confidence and the way that he wants to play. I think it's really going to show off like my capabilities as a player. Um, I think that's important for me right now is uh, just to get my head down and keep working hard and get on the football pitch and then just let the football do the talking and show people what I can do really It's been uh, well documented that um, you know, the team doesn't trouble to score goals but sort of sit there and let in quite a few in the last couple of seasons the manager spoke to you about that and how you help improve your defensive record um, Well hopefully, hopefully we can improve it um, obviously that's why he's bringing me in Obviously, being a centre back, my job is to obviously organise and lead the back three or four, whatever we play. Um, and obviously, if we have that, you know, pedestal that goes us on to games to be able to win the games, if we are able to keep a clean sheet, so um, that's going to be my job, and along with the other defenders, obviously, and hopefully we can uh, improve on last season. For anyone that hasn't seen you play, how would you describe your, your sort of play style? Um, so I'm a centre back who's confident on the ball, um, comfortable in possession, um, like to step in with the ball. Uh, feel like I'm a good defender as well, good in the air, um, good in the tackle. So hopefully I can just show people what I can do here. And um, yeah, I feel like it was a good fit. You're obviously no stranger to the South Coast, having had spells at Winchester and Haven and Paul, etc. You obviously made your name at, at Bogner. Uh, there's obviously a fair bit of rivalry amongst the supporters of our club in theirs. Do you have any um, experience or memories of the derby matches from the ones you played in? Uh, yeah, obviously, obviously they were always the games you looked forward to when I was at Bognor because you know you get like two, two and a half thousand people, um, and it's always nice when it's a bit of a derby. It's a bit more of an atmosphere. Um, but obviously, got nothing but good things about Bognor to say. Um, They've always been supportive, supportive of me on my career, and um, yeah, I'm happy to be here now. Now, well, obviously, you've had a few Worthing fans uh, commenting on your Twitter. Yeah, uh, I did see that. Yeah, yeah you saw. Yeah, I was going to say you've mentioned yeah. noticed that. So they've obviously uh, let that ball in the collection slide. Um, and just lastly, uh, obviously, coming off the back of two seasons in the, the National League South for the club, fourth and third place finishes. What, what do you see this season? How do you see this going? What are their sort of ambitions for you as a player and also with the team? Uh, well, I think I'm a winner, so my, my ambitions is to finish as high as we can. Like, obviously, we want to get promoted third and fourth in the last two years. If we can get better than that, then obviously we're in a good position. Um, you know, obviously, it's a tough league. There's a lot of big, big sides in the league. It's not going to be easy, but um, I think with the side that we're building... Um, the players that have come in and the players that are staying, um, you know, got a real good side to compete, and I'm looking forward to seeing what we can do.